Hey everyone, Rachel from Sailor Size here. In this week's video, we're going to share with you a dinner we make pretty regularly during these hot summer nights. It's a salad, but there's gonna be lots of different ingredients on top and make it super delicious and something you can do easy at home when you're looking for a quick meal that's super nutritious and delicious. So let's get started. Okay, so how do we get started? First, we start with our base. So you can see our fresh lettuce here. This is a spring mix. So we have a bunch of different um, lettuce in there. And then, but you can really use whatever you have at home or whatever your favorite is. We kind of change it up. Sometimes we do spinach. Sometimes we do romaine, um, arugula, really whatever you are feeling or have at home will work. So you can see both of ours are filled, making two salads here, one for Matt and one for myself. Um, the next thing we're gonna add is we're going to add a cucumber. So I'm gonna chop this guy up and then I have a bell pepper. Um, this is a yellow one, whatever you like can work. Um, then I have some broccoli here that we're gonna chop up. We have some carrots that we're gonna add. We have some alfalfa sprouts, love our sprouts. So we're gonna add those. And then we also have some fresh tomatoes. And then finally, um, well not finally, but also I found these tropical avocados at the store. So we're gonna add one of these. And then finally we'll top it with some nuts. I have some cashew nuts. Uh, Brazil nuts and some uh, sunflower um, seeds. So that is what we're going to make our uh, salad with and it's super easy. Add all those ingredients and make it look super delicious. So here, let's get started. After you have your base, then you cut all your veggies up, as you can see we just did here. So all our delicious veggies are cut, and now we're going to top our salad with all these veggies. All our veggies are cut and topped on our salad mix there, but we're not done yet. We still have some other ingredients to add. We have our alfalfa sprouts, so I'm going to add some of those to... Matt's salad and then to my salad and then the other thing we have is our tropical avocado and then we're gonna put some nuts on the top of the salad and then top it off with some salad dressing so still not done but it looks super delicious there I'm excited about this after a long day of work it looks so good so we have this tropical avocado that I got at the store and it's soft and ready it's huge. That's one fun thing about the tropical avocados. And it looks like it's going to be perfectly ripe. So I'm only going to use, as you can see, because it's such a big avocado. Uh, it's a little brown on the inside, but that's okay. That happens. Um, so it's probably still good. Sometimes you might have to cut around things if it gets a little too brown. In our van, things get to ripe a little bit quicker because of the warm temperatures. But I'm gonna cut some of that up and I'm top it on our salad. And then I'm gonna cut the, I'm actually gonna cut this up and then put it in a Tupperware um, and put some lemon on it so then I can use it for tomorrow. So use as much as you can. You could also cover this up and leave the um, seed in there and then cover it up and then cut it tomorrow, but I'm just gonna make my life easier for tomorrow and cut it all up tonight. Okay, we have our avocado on there. It's almost there, our salad's almost done. And the last thing we're gonna add is some, um, we have some sunflower seeds and then I'm gonna add some nuts, but kind of just sprinkle it on, get a little bit crunch going. Um, another thing I like to add sometimes is like chickpeas or um, beans. Tonight we are not adding those, but just some nuts. And then I have some Brazil nuts. I'll put like two on each salad. 
And then I have some cashews and I'll just put a couple on each salad here and just give it a little bit of crunch for the salad. And that is pretty much done. And then the last thing is salad dressing. So I try to make my own salad dressing, but life has been busy just like we all are. So I have been buying some salad dressing. Recently found this one here and we both really enjoy it. And it's pretty um, great good ingredients organic there's not too many ingredients in it but really delicious um salad dressing and then just top a little bit of that and we are ready to chow down on dinner after a long day of work um but super good you can see all those yummy ingredients super nutritious so we're excited about this dinner and this has been a staple in our little van life one day we will be growing all of this food um, when we have our land somewhere warm but right now we are finding local organic produce where we can and enjoying it all. So let's eat this delicious meal. All right, there you go. Here's our dinner for the night and what we've been making most nights. Super delicious. So many different uh, raw, beautiful ingredients on there that will nourish our bodies and we will feel ready for the day tomorrow. So we've been doing a lot of this and we're excited for this dinner. After a long day at work, salads don't have to be boring. You can make a delicious salad, and we just made one here. Everybody always says, oh, you just eat grass. I don't just eat grass. This is what I eat, and it's super good. So give it a try at your home, buy these ingredients, and you will not be sorry that you didn't make the salad. So go ahead and make this, and thanks for watching as always, and we will catch you next time.